I went too far. I made a mistake and I was wrong. Well, that's all well and good, but too late. Kathy Griffin fired by CNN over that photo of her holding a bloody Trump head. And if that's not bad enough, the photo has now caught the attention of the Secret Service. Oh yeah, they're very, very, very well aware of this uh, picture. Could have gone with a wear. Very, very much so, and they're investigating everybody involved. Now, clearly Kathy doesn't plan to hurt the president. But they have a protocol. And they can't say, okay, we'll make an exception because we happen to know this comedian or that. They get a thousand of these yeah. tips a day and they're required to look into every single one of them. And they have to, yeah. But it's kind of the least of Kathy's problems. Nearly everyone is turning on her saying this goes too far. Republicans, Democrats, Hollywood, even her BFF. Anderson didn't just say he didn't like it. Anderson went after her. For the record, I'm appalled by the photo shoot Kathy Griffin took part in. It is clearly disgusting and completely inappropriate. But he has to go harsh after her because if he's soft on her, it hurts his credibility. To me, it's, it doesn't matter who the president is when you do something like that. You just don't do it. So the good thing that came out of this is maybe we found a line. Got it. So making fun of the president for inventing the word kafifi, Good. Holding his bloody decapitated head? Not good. But at least Kathy apologized. Uh, she apologized because, because her endorsers were leaving her. Oh my God, she lost Squatty Potty. So get yourself a Squatty Potty. And stop being so full of They dumped her. <laughs> we're TMZ if you like our vibe. Subscribe, we'll send you more!